and start manifesting. I'm trying, I'm trying to tell y'all, there has never been something that I manifested heavily and it did not happen. You better get on it. So I cried up to the side of my mountain. Until you reach my peak, babe. And welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. Today we will be reviewing, I believe it's pronounced Tahiki hair. They were kind enough to send me some clippings. Now, usually you know I'm a wig girl. I don't do clippings, but we're going to give it a try and see. So the hair is 16 inches. It is 100% human hair. Um, this is like a light brown texture, light brown colored hair. And it comes with eight clippings. So we are going to install it and give our opinion. Stay tuned. Sometimes I don't think we really see love. Why is it so hard to keep in touch when we're laying right next to each other, baby? We shouldn't read into things too much, overthinking, understanding. Don't let a feeling change it up. I wanna spend my nights with you, my life with you. They might be on or something. Wig who? <laughs> do y'all see this curl? Do, do somebody hello? Do y'all see this curl that this hair is getting? <laughs> hunty, hunty.
Do y'all see this? Do y'all see this? <laughs> Baby, it took me like five minutes to get the clippings in. Um, I could have worn it straight just how it was, but I decided to throw a couple curls in there real quick. Y'all listen. <laughs> Somebody feeling themselves. Okay, I may never wear another wig again. The only thing I probably would change is that I probably would get um, solid black next time so it'll blend even better with my hair. But listen, I'm sold. Baby, listen. Somebody feeling themselves. Somebody's cute, okay? <laughs> listen, I absolutely, absolutely love it. When they reached out to me and asked me to try out this hair i was like no i don't do clippings i only do wigs and whatnot i'm so glad that i decided to give it a try i am in absolute love y'all oh i love it and i will definitely even if i have to purchase it with my own coin i will definitely give this a second try like i said i probably would just get all black next time but i absolutely love them y'all give them a try the link will be down below thank you for watching hey y'all hey it is may 1st 2 50 in the afternoon i just got out of the shower um i spent the whole morning finishing up editing all of my vlogs except for some past um travel vlogs but i'm gonna get that done too um but i had to take a pause for the calls because these children keep saying they hungry so i um i'm about to go fix them something to eat and then i am getting ready to clean up my bathroom and do the stuff you usually do on sunday so stick with me yes i'm still naked headed but y'all don't worry about that that's gonna be handled stay tuned y'all i lied so i went downstairs to make something to eat and that gets down there and these children have every single cabinet door open the pantry door open. Both pantry doors was open. Stuff everywhere. I got so mad. Let me calm down. It's a trigger for me when every single cabinet door is open. Like, I cannot stand the cabinet doors open. I don't like the shower curtain being open after you took a shower. Like certain stuff. It's just triggers for me and they know this so why i go down there and every single cabinet door is open and both pantry doors are open and there's stuff everywhere no i kind of put me some tuna in a bowl turned around and came back in my room then you so hungry but it's a big old plate of leftover french fries they done made and some chicken strips in the microwave Y'all think food is free? So if you hungry, that's what you finna eat because I'm not making anything. So I came right on back in my room. Let me show y'all what I'm eating. This is just some, um, y'all know the little tuna that come in the packs. This is just some, um, some sweet chili tuna out the pack. And then I added a little extra sweet chili sauce to it and some pepper. And this is what I'm eating. Um, this is how I eat my tuna. I don't put all that other extra stuff in it. And, you know, it's Sunday. So, I'm waiting on Gina and Jay and Maya to post their dog on Sunday videos. EJ already posted hers. 
and I need to figure out how to work my gimbal because I just tried to use it and I just cannot, I can't figure it out, y'all. So I'm finna um, search up on YouTube how to work my gimbal because I paid all that money for it and it needs to be used. Now y'all stay tuned again. Y'all trying to figure out how to work this gimbal has really just irritated my entire soul. Like, my entire soul. And I'm really considering just going ahead and just sending it back and just using just a regular tripod because the gimbal might just not be for me. And I think I'm going to send it back. And I'm so disappointed because I really, really want it. But I just cannot get it to work right. Good morning, y'all. It is May 2nd. I just woke up. Um, it is... 6 30 on the dot and we are ooh, excuse me getting these kids ready for school so have y'all had these the first time i heard about uh celsius um gina spoke about it on her channel and then after that several other people that i watch on youtube was talking about it so i figured i'd try it because i don't like red bulls or anything like that but y'all know from watching my videos that i'm constantly yawning so i figured i'd try it out um one thing i did like about it is they have carbonated and non-carbonated and i don't drink carbonated drinks so i thought it was it would be something good to try so my husband brought me one home yesterday so i'm gonna try it today and see how that goes but y'all stay tuned let me get up and get these kids together check back in with y'all shortly Ooh, excuse me see i'm always yawning so i just tried the celsius y'all and it's good it doesn't have like that nasty red bull like taste to it it was it was decent it's something i could see me drinking i, I could see me drinking it and plus they have a lot of flavors i would be willing to try so we'll we'll see we'll see but i'm about to go drop these nappy headed children off um at school I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So I am about to try to get myself together. It is 8.25. And I am trying to go get my hair washed because I was supposed to do it myself this weekend. And then I was like, no, I don't want to. So I'm going to pull up on my favorite Dominican shop. I think they open this morning at 10. And so I'm gonna try to get there at nine something because I do not have an appointment. So I'm gonna try to get there at nine something so I can be there when they get there. So hopefully they can put me on in as soon as they open because y'all know I'm not patient. I don't wanna have to wait. So, up above you. Excuse me, y'all know I'm always young. So I am about to just do my eyebrows and get somewhat decent and um, going on up here so they can make me look human again because I gotta do, I have a brand deal that I need to get done and turned in hopefully by today. Um, so that's what I'm trying to accomplish today. Um, I have already completed my manifestations for today. Um, I'm drinking my um, Celsius energy drink and I want to, I got a few clients I need to reach out to this afternoon um, and then I want to rework some of my goals today. So, um, yeah, so that's what I'm about to do, y'all. So I am listening to, I was listening to a YouTube video. Excuse me. Gosh. A YouTube video, um, but I think I'm about to turn on some music because music gets me motivated. Where's my Spotify? Y'all use Spotify? I love Spotify. I use Spotify so much, they need to sponsor me. And um, that's one bill. I don't mind paying. It's my Spotify. All right, y'all stay tuned. 
I think it's either from Shein, Fashion Nova, some black leggings from DD's, one size fits all. I absolutely love them. And some black and orange Adidas. And my poof. Y'all see this hot mess? I ain't do too much to it because I'm about to go get it washed. So, that little thing sitting, y'all. Y'all see, I'm getting a little booty. All right, let me go. All right, y'all, it is 921, and the uh, um, Dominican shop is like about 25, 30 minutes away. So I probably will get there a tad bit before 10 o'clock. But in my experience, every time I go, they are never on time getting work anyway. So every time I've ever gone, I've always beat them there. Now the original owner of this shop, I know she was in the hospital last time I went. She wasn't doing too good. And this other girl was running her shop. I think the girl, they gave the girl the shop. I don't know if the lady died or not. But she was so, 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 so sweet. And she was fast. And when I tell you, when you will go to her to get your hair washed and blown out, baby, your hair will be bone straight like your head was straighter than paper okay and she was real gentle too this other girl that did my hair last time she was in the shop i didn't really care for her she was super rough i felt like she was ripping my hair out like i had to tell her hey 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 can you can you not be so rough and for a heavy-handed person like me to have to tell somebody to not be rough baby you rough okay because i knew i'm rough but yeah, I had to tell her, and she wasn't as fast. Lord have mercy. It's a huge, big old box flying down the middle of the lane. I'm glad there wasn't no car coming, so I could go around it. That thing's big. Um, so I'm hoping that um, the original lady that she um, you know, pulled through got better and she back in the shop. But I don't think so because I think... Um, 
last time I passed by there, I think they changed the moniker on the top and changed it to the other girl's name. So, but hopefully she got better. She not as rough and she's fast because y'all know I'm not patient. So, we shall see. Now, it is 9.23 in the morning. Have y'all done y'all manifestations yet? Have y'all have y'all prayed? Have you manifested? Have you done whatever it is that you do to uh, call on the universe, call on God, uh, wh whoever you are uh, referring to? Have you done whatever you needed to do to get this thing rolling this morning, to, to bring whatever it is you're trying to bring? Have you done that? If not, get it done after you watch this video. And let's get to it, okay? In the meantime, I need to manifest me some chocolate into this universe because I don't have any more. Hmm. I'll be back. Side note, if y'all wondering what is this that's always in my in my video, these are my beat um headphones, the earbuds that wrap around your ear. So, uh, somebody that I used to follow on YouTube, I just so happened to be looking at one of her videos of must-have things or something like that, and she works out a lot. Um, and she was talking about these headphones and how you can do backflips, run, jump, and all of that stuff, and they don't go anywhere. And so, I, um, when I am on my workout kit, I like to jog, and I hate, I don't like the cord, but I use the earbuds with the cord because it seems like they're the loudest. And I don't like headphones over my head because they're just too big and bulky. Um, and then I don't like the earbuds that just go in your ear because especially when you're jogging and running, so they fall out. So when she was talking about these, I was like, I gotta get them. So I got them, um, and then I've always heard good things about Beats by Dre and how they're loud and this, that, and the third. So I invested in them and I got some. And sorry y'all about the sun glare, but, and I got some and y'all, they are heavenly. Do you hear me when I tell you? They're heavenly. Get you some Beats by Dre. Uh, these are called, what are these called? Power, the Power Beats Pro, something like that. Just look for the picture where they wrap around right here. Y'all, I love these headphones. They never fall out, ever. No matter what I'm doing, they are in place. You hear me? I love them. I love, 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 love them. And um, another thing I like about them is I can keep them in my ear and um, be able to hear people good. Because the last earbuds I had when they were in my ear, everything sounds so muffled to me. And like if somebody was talking to me, I would have to take them out to be able to clearly be able to hear what the people were saying to me. But with these, I can have them all the way in my ear sitting comfortably. Oh, my nail got a snake. I can have them all the way in my ear sitting comfortably and I can still hear what people are saying to me without a problem. Like, I don't have anything bad to say about these headphones. Um, I think they are definitely well worth the price. And when I went to St. Thomas, I actually lost one in the airport. I left it in the bin. I feel like, um, look at Tyler Perry House. That thing looks so nice. You can see it so good from right here. I'm going to try to show y'all on the way back. But um, I live walking distance to Tyler Perry, y'all. I love it. But anyway, um, what was I saying? See, I be getting so sidetracked. Oh, I was saying I left um, this earbud in the bin at TSA in Orlando and it was such a hassle to try to get it back that I just reordered one. So you can actually order one beat at a time, like a replacement beat, if you lose it. And that, that, was, that was a blessing instead of me having to reorder all of it. You can actually reorder each uh, piece. You can reorder the case. You can order an extra case. It's wonderful, y'all. I actually, I ordered it on um, the replacement beat. I ordered it off of eBay. And so that was a blessing. Y'all get y'all some beats by Dre. They're wonderful. All right, y'all. I was in and up out of that joint. Um, in a few minutes over than an hour. That's what I'm talking about. You see, your girl look human again. I look human. 
I need my ends trimmed so bad, but I want them to do that today because you know, my family, we believe in the moons. And you all, my mama always, you know, you always supposed to get your um, ends clipped on the new moon. And I didn't have time to look and see when the new moon was. So I told that lady in the ma'am, we, we can't clip them today. Cause I gotta call my mama and check and see is it time to clip some ends. But, um, so yeah, my ends look real bad, but yeah, it looked a little bad, but it, it's gonna be all right for right now. Um. But I have not been taking care of my hair, so it looked real short to me compared to what I'm used to it looking like. Um, but now I'm finna zoom up here and see if this restaurant is open that has smoked salmon. Y'all, they food is so good. It's expensive, but it is so good. And it's all the way over here in Mableton, so whenever I come out this way, that's the only time I can go there. But they hours are kind of weird. So every time I try to go there, they be closed. But anyway, we're going to zoom on up here and see if they open. And then I'm going to go home and do this dog on um, um, brand deal stuff I need to do. And I think that's about, boy, they're going to tore all that down too. I think that's really about it that I need to get done, that I have to get done for the day. So that's good. Stay tuned. Hopefully when I get back on here, I'm going to have some real delicious food to show y'all. Hopefully. Well, that's another disappointment. It's 11.30 and they don't open till 12. And I'm not going to sit here and wait. Especially because what I want is um, smoked salmon and it don't even look like it's any grills or nothing going already to have that prepared for 12 o'clock. And I'm not going to sit here and be disappointed and waste my time. So maybe I'll come back later this afternoon and I'll drive back out here. We'll see. I'm probably lying, but we'll see. I'm going to just stop by Captain D's. And probably get me some french fries and sweet, sweet and sour sauce. Because they have good french fries and sweet sour sauce. So that's probably what I will do. I'm so disappointed. I can taste that food. Like everything that I've ever had from there is delicious. The mac and cheese, the yams, all of that. All of that. But I'm not going to wait. They're not going to play with me today and my taste buds. Okay, so have y'all experienced, I'm pretty sure you have, where you grew up with people or y'all were once so close, you know, friends or whatever, and it's like you grew up, but they didn't, or y'all mindsets are just so different now. So it's kind of hard to have a conversation with that person now because y'all just don't. And then it's like the stuff they want to talk about, you're not really interested in talking about. And so it's like, maybe y'all bump heads or it's like, I, I, I don't really know how to explain what I'm thinking, but now I'm a work phone ring. What I'm thinking, but I keep experiencing that. And it's like, I don't be trying to be funny or, um, make people feel no type of way if i do I'm, I'm not sure if i do or if i don't but it's just like you know i'm just i don't know i don't spend my time talking about certain stuff um it's certain stuff that i don't do so the conversations that's gone i'm trying to filter my words because i don't know you know if these people watch my videos or not and i ain't trying to offend anybody but I'm just trying to figure out the common ground because it's like I like these people in my life, but at the same time, um, I don't know how to fix that gap that's there. It's like this stuff they want to talk about, I don't talk about stuff that they find entertaining or funny, I don't find entertaining and funny. Some things that they do, I don't do. 
you know um but it's like we can go out and have a good time and so I'm like, you know, it are, are certain people just in my life for when I want to go out and have a good time. I just feel like that kind of ain't right, you know. But at the same time, it's like I just, I'm looking at the conversation or listening to the conversation like, oh, God. you know what I'm saying? It's a chore for me. It's a, it's a task. It's taxing on me because I don't, mm -mm, this ain't what I do. Let me get my thoughts together. I'm going to have to talk to T.Y. about this so that I can talk talk about it unfiltered and really get it off my chest so he can help me work through this because it's been on my mind for a little minute. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do about it. But let me order this food, y'all. I'll be right back. So, y'all, I think I'm really feeling this way because I don't, I mean, you know, as I go, go up the ladder in success, I need to clip. As I grow up, the, go up the ladder of success or whatever, you know what I'm saying? I just don't um, want it to ever come off as, oh, you forgot where you came from or you too good now or, you know, anything like that. I just, I really don't want it to, I don't. I don't want my growth in any way, fashion, or form to come off like that. But at the same time, as you grow as an individual, your mindset change, you know, your focus change, and all of that stuff, you know what I'm saying? So how, how do you prevent that? And I, I guess as you grow, you kind of do outgrow people, but... to obtain goals and be successful in life it's a it's a it's a struggle it's a it's a on, on multiple levels it's a mm, I don't know I can't really say what I want to say how I want to say it I guess I should have never brought it up but it's just on my mind real heavy and it's on my heart so yeah I'm gonna have to have a conversation with you guys. yeah that's my diary him and my sister cousin Jasmine. Or maybe I need to call Jasmine. But yeah. I, I, I just I just don't know. Oh. Uh, may I have some sweet and sour sauce? Thank you. You put the sauce in here? Okay, they changed the page. Thank you. Be sure, Wendy. Y'all, I actually got food. We're going to see if I eat it. I got, oh, some. Oh, my gosh. This is so. Y'all, let me show y'all this so y'all can see. I ain't over there, but hold on. Look at this. Look how skimp this look. Y'all really can't. I feel like y'all can't tell on camera. This looks so sad to me. See y'all, this is why I don't eat. Because... Usually Captain D's has really good french fries, but these french fries are old and cold tasting. And um I I, I really don't want these. But I'm ready to go home. So I'm just probably give this food to TY. No, I'm not. I paid too much for this. I'm gonna go back through this drive through. I'm not, no. Yes, I'm that person. I, I work too hard for my money. So, um, no. Let me taste this fish.
The fish is definitely hot, but we don't have that much flavor to it. But it's doable. This needs prayer. Let us all bow our heads in the name of this food because this is trash. I'm just trying to figure out if the quality of food going down or I'm just getting more and more picky. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Hold on, y'all. Okay, so he gave me some, some more fries. Let me see. It might be me, y'all. It might be me. These are a little better. I don't know why I bought a whole meal knowing good and well. I was only gonna eat the french fries <coughs> and sweet and sour sauce. I had to do better. I haven't talked to y'all about investments in a while. One of these um, accounts that I have going, um, I think it makes 3.3% a day on your investment. And um, it has doubled my money, more than doubled my money actually, in a month. Y'all should look into it. I'll put the link down below um, for anybody that's interested. Hey, Editing Rain, put the link down below for the 3.3% a day account. Yeah, y'all, I um I deal with a lot of investments, and you know that's also one of the things that my channel is about is you know multiple streams of income and investments and stuff like that. So if y'all are interested, I'll put the info down. Hey, you gotta get how you live out here. You gotta make your money, make your money. Y'all heard about my girl Megan. Meg the Stallion. Y'all know I like Meg the Stallion. Anyway, so I'm listening to the radio and they said that um she just got the keys to the city of Houston and that they deemed May 2nd, which is her mom and her grandmother's birthday, you know, both of them passed. But it's both of their birthdays and so they uh, made May 2nd um, uh, Megan Day, officially Meg Day in Houston. That's cool. That's cool, cool things right there. That's, that gotta be such an honor. I love me some Meg the Stallion. I think all her songs, you know, pretty much are the same. But it still be hitting, though. <laughs> <laughs>
So I just finished tucking my kids in, right? So I came on here to say, hold on, let me. This my eye mask, y'all. Anywho, um, I came on here to say, God be moving. You hear me? Manifestation is real. And if y'all don't believe it, I feel sorry for you. Okay? You're missing out. You're missing out real bad. So, remember I told y'all I was manifesting. T.Y. T.Y. He can't hear me because he got his hey. headphones on. Ho hold on, y'all. Hold on. Oh, my bad. You recording? Yes, I'm recording. I just want to say. Hey, He just made a new beat and he's so excited about it. Y'all excuse him. It sounds divine. When I say sound good, you need to hear it when you get a chance to finish. Excuse me. But when you get a chance to come this to it, like, I'll send it to you. See why I don't listen to three today. I made four. You can listen to the fourth one. Okay. But this one sounds really good. Excuse me. As soon as I start talking, he start talking again. No, I'm not. I might play a little snippet of, of one of the beats for y'all. Oh. Anyway, like I was trying to say, so my manifestation. So remember, I was telling y'all. That I was manifesting my next level or whatever, right? So, ever since I started manifesting it and manifesting it, y'all, people just been coming out the woodworks. Just, just coming out the woodworks. And I, I haven't even done anything yet for them to, I just finished wrapping my hair and... It's uh, clearly I did not do a good job. It's sticking all out of my bonnet, sticking all out of my bonnet. But I digress. So, um, I haven't even started my marketing campaign or anything yet, y'all, to get the people to get to my next level. But the people just been coming out of the woodworks, just just out of the clear blue sky you know why because that's how god works that's how manifestation works you gotta put it out there so that it can come to fruit 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 i'm so excited i can't even talk y'all if you wish you know what i'm talking about don't play with me Y'all better get your goals down on paper and start manifesting. I'm trying, I'm trying to tell y'all. There has never been something that I manifested heavily and it did not happen. You better get on it. Okay? It's real. That's all I got for y'all. I'm finna go to bed. I think. Or at least I'm finna lay and watch YouTube. Until I get sleepy. But you know I had that Celsius drink earlier today. So maybe that's why I'm not sleepy. I didn't even drink the whole drink. But I feel wide awake right now. Like I could I could go do some work. I could go do something. I could go out. Like I'm not sleepy at all. But I ain't going to talk y'all to death. I'm going to get myself together. Maybe I'll upload what I have of this vlog so far. And go ahead and start editing it. Maybe I'll be productive with my time. And then watch I get sleepy. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all later.